What is going on you guys? Welcome back to another video. I'm on the Grom today. I'm the Grom clone, I'm sorry. I just like saying the Grom because everybody thinks that it's a Grom when they see it. But it's not a Grom, obviously. It's a Grom clone. <laughs> Well, yeah, the the chain is real loose right now. I gotta tighten it up. I'm not sure why I got loose though. No, I don't want these gloves to get dirty. Hey guys, this is the bike. Um, as you can see, it's riding perfectly fine. I gotta I gotta fix the a couple things, you know. Uh, this grease, I gotta clean that up. This the nasty sticker residue, I gotta clean that up. Got some more right here. I kind of don't like having a kill switch here, but it's all good. Looks more of like a stunt bike. Do a little wheelie real quick. Why they go sideways? It went like the complete opposite way. <laughs> Woo, that felt good. <laughs> Alright, let me stop. I'm gonna get the cops called on. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that felt really good though. On that piece right there that I just did. Yeah, it's definitely grinding on that. <laughs> the chain. That's right guys. I got a new chain, a new rear sprocket, and a new front sprocket. So you guys are here to watch me install that on this bike. I forgot. So let's go ahead and do that. Alrighty guys, so we are back home and uh, let's go ahead and install this sprocket all right guys so first and foremost this is what i got i got it from some website <laughs> i'm not even sure what it was but it's the 37 rear sprocket and the 14 front sprocket i already have the 14 in the front but i'm just gonna go ahead and put this other new one since we're gonna put a new chain on it and everything so and the chain is a longer chain obviously it's a 420 Bracket is a 420, so we should be good. All right, guys, so let's remove the rear axle. And on this side, it's gonna be a 14, and the other side is gonna be a 17. So let's Alright, so I've never done this before, so this is going to be a pretty good one. Just like that, we took off the chain link. <laughs> now we take this one off. Like that. the old chain all right so I got some of the super cleaner uh -oh, I'm gonna try to clean this a little bit I'm not gonna 
gonna lie, this thing does a really good job. So, I've never really changed a sprocket on one of these small bikes before. And for some reason I thought this was a bracket that you put this on, but it doesn't look like this comes off. It looks like it's pins that are like pretty much permanent on there. So I'm just gonna install it like this and pray to God that it works. I just realized I wasn't even recording, but the front sprocket is in. Um, let's go ahead and put the back. We got all these parts clean for the axle. Let's go ahead and lube it up and put the rear wheel on. There we go guys, I had these tight, <laughs> that's why. I did that the first time that I did that wheelie as you guys saw in the beginning of the video it did not go up that easy it, I barely gave it gas and it came up holy crap oh my god that is I I'm sorry guys I don't have any brackets on me or anything for the camera I literally have it on a, on a selfie stick Wow, that feels good. And that's first gear, Willie. Really. 